Small business in the Arts District in downtown Las Vegas, the latest victim of copper theft. Yeah, and this time it's Good Pie. It's a popular pizza restaurant. It's in the heart of the Arts District, and it had to close for hours today after employees found that all of the food there had gone bad. The locally owned business was able to reopen for its dinner rush, but the owner says the loss will be in the tens of thousands of dollars. And News 3's Ambar Rodriguez is live there now with more details for us. Ambar? That's right. When staff got here this morning, they found the AC off and their walk-in fridge where the business keeps and stores its pizza dough was hot. When they went to go look into the issue, they found its wires had been cut from its HVAC compressor, forcing the business to close, losing thousands of dollars. Now the owner, Vincent Rotolo, the owner of Good, P Good Pie, says enough is enough. As News 3 has been reporting, this isn't the first small business to lose thousands of dollars because of the theft. In April, April, I reported Cork and Thorn, which is just down the street from here, had also been impacted. Since then, several other small businesses, including the Honey Pot Inc., posted on social media that it had been hit by copper thieves as well. Based on repair costs, insurance claims, lost product, lost wages, there's a team that's here today that we're paying out, lost revenue, but it's also the emotional factor. Like, we've been violated. Like, that hurts. Like the mental health impact of this far outweighs the financial impact of this. And it's just, we care about our businesses. Like, why are, why are we allowing this to happen? We need to take our community back. Rotolo says, thankfully, this time, the suspects didn't finish the job and were only able to get with a, with away with a few pieces of metal. But the impact of the loss on small businesses has a ripple effect. It's hard. No, it, it hurts. But our community's stronger than that. Like, we're not going to let fear, like, overpower love. Good Pie is about sharing love. And this community built this brand. The community built Good Pie. And the community is going to be the one to help us survive. And so they're going to come out, they're going to support, and we'll get through this. But it's, it takes a toll. And it's one more thing to worry about. And the love is already getting, it's being shared here. Some of our viewers that was actually watching News 3 at 5 and saw the story actually are inside and supporting the small business. Now tomorrow, City Council will be looking at a solution, hopefully adopting an ordinance that would require sellers of this metal and copper to actually have paperwork in order to prove that they bought it legally. For now, reporting live from downtown in the Art District, Ambar Rodriguez, back to you in the studio. All right, Ambar, we're making a difference. Thank you so much.